Poem Twelve by Ezra Pound from Hugh Selwyn Mauberly, Part One. This is a LibriVox recording. All LibriVox recordings are in the public domain. Reading by Bologna Times. Daphne, with her thighs and bark, stretches toward me her leafy hands. Subjectively, in the stuffed satin drawing-room, I await the Lady Valentine's commands. Knowing my coat has never been of precisely the fashion to stimulate in her a durable passion. Doubtful, somewhat, of the value of well-gowned approbation, of literary effort, but never of the Lady Valentine's vocation. Poetry, her border of ideas, the edge, uncertain, but a means of blending with other strata, where the lower and higher have ending. A hook to catch the Lady Jane's attention, a modulation toward the theatre. Also, in the case of revolution, a possible friend and comforter. Conduct, on the other hand, the soul which the highest cultures have nourished, to Fleet Street, where Dr. Johnson flourished. Beside this thoroughfare, the sale of half-hose has long since superseded the cultivation of Pyrian roses. End of poem. This recording is in the public domain.